Hello, this is my Brachypalma Vagans Mexican Red Rump. Uh, again, uh, this one is uh, from Mexico, but it can also be found as far south as Belize and El Salvador, Guatemala, and even Florida, the U.S. Um, it is terrestrial, so again, the enclosure, they prefer it longer rather than tall. Uh, they are definitely on the skittish side. In fact, of all the brackies, I think this one is the most skittish. And mine is no exception to that. Mine is very fast and eats like a pig. Um, they can grow up to be about six inches. They actually get quite stocky uh, as a brackie. So... Uh, that's the deal on that one as far as upkeep goes. Nothing special, with, like I said, with temperature with all the others. Just make sure the um, temperature is comfortable the way you're comfortable with it. Um, humidity, nothing special. Just keep a full water dish. And I'm filling it up right now. And uh, what I'm going to do is feed this one a superworm. Uh and uh, try not to scare it so much where it runs out of the enclosure. Like I said, this one is very skittish. So, uh, I'm not, misplaced my feeding tongs, of course. Oh, there they are. You know what? I don't like you there. No, you don't go down. Oh, the egg. Did you see that? Oh, no, you ain't. Did you just see that? You see all that? Hairs. See all the hairs? Yeah, that's a Brachypalma Baggins for you. Good thing I wear glasses, huh? Hey, come back here. Come back here. I'm not done with you. There. Hmm. But did you see what it did when it was up here? It actually struck at the tongs. Yeah, that's why I need a paintbrush, but yeah, I don't have one. So we have to make do with what we have. So I'm going to offer it a super worm. Good for you. Even though you bit my tongs and you flicked a bunch of hairs at me, I'll give you food. How about that? This one, uh, as you saw, likes to either hang up at the top of the cave or inside the cave. And it's done some webbing, just kind of around the area there. But yeah, of all the brackies, the Vagans is probably the most skittish. Definitely don't recommend handling them because they're nuts. <laughs> and mine certainly is. Yeah, she's kind of cranky today. But she's happy to have a worm, so... I'm glad I could appease her. <laughs> yeah, she's she's definitely one of my more skittish teas. Mm -hmm. Alright, folks. This is all of the uh Brachypalma Vagans I will feature. Now you got the idea. 
on what they're like. Uh, the next tea I will feature in my next video will be the Ceratogyrus brachycephalus. So say goodbye to the Brachypoma vagans. Enjoy your worm. <laughs> Alright, thanks.